Hey guys, the Brand Real Fan here. Just doing a quick layout update. I think it's number five, I want to say. Basically, what I've done since last time is uh, cleaned off this board. Got those two off the stairwell. I got the two by fours and everything cut. I just have to build the table now that goes from that wall there to this wall. Cut a foot off. I think it's about a foot and two inches off of one of those two. And then it'll just go on the end here. Just because that wall is 14 feet, 10 inches. But of course those two are eight feet long. So it's a little long, but I have to cut it down. So th this table will get shoved back by about a foot-ish. Oh, and I should. Sure, I found a piece of bone. I just gotta grab it, it's just outside of the train area. Why is there wood on top of it? <laughs> Sorry, this piece is very large and heavy and I completely forgot about it until just now. But on top of... Ugh. This massive sheet, it's like... Uh, I'd say about oops, two feet wide by about... Uh, almost six feet tall. And it's gonna actually have these little... Ray's city on it that's gonna go. I'm gonna put it right here on top of there. I still have to actually put this part of the main line in here. I still haven't. Um, sharing off the controller. The other way that all this has stayed the same, I still have to raise this guy. Still gotta move that TV. <laughs> I've also added that section of foam in there, that block there, the block there, create some texturing there. I have to put a block, in fact, I'll take you guys a bit closer for that. Don't know why I put the foam right where I need to walk, but there you go. As you guys can see, I don't, I have to put a piece in to fill this gap. I gotta texture this down, oh, so uh, this down so it matches up. Because obviously, it doesn't match up with that piece there. I'm not sure if I'm going to continue the hole on the top like I was thinking about doing there. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to do that yet. Not sure what I'm like really gonna do on top of these. I'll fill these little cracks in too. That's where the line is. But yeah, you guys can see here it's gonna be ignore the table underneath there. You guys can see it's kind of how I'm being traded. I'm not I don't think I'm gonna plaster, I think I'll just paint this. Uh just to give it a more rough look. We're gonna have another bridge here that's gonna go right where it is now. I just gotta cut the piece of foam to length. And let's try to, I'll try to show you guys how the incline works. Assuming it wants to. It, it doesn't want to half the time. No, I'm not going to use a steam engine for this. I'm going to use, why is it up there? I keep the foam when I'm working, like that. those pieces of foam when I'm working with it on the table. I just put them on the ground behind me so they're out of the way. Then me getting in the way. I'm just going to use an F40 pH for this, my life like one. Because it's just a little bit easier to use. Uh oh. She hasn't run in a while. Oh, boy. The little guy. For some reason, they're struggling this weekend. I don't know why. Something causing them to struggle. The F40PH failed me. Well, we'll get old reliable MT on it. I shouldn't say old reliable because it, it actually failed me earlier. Don't stop there. Don't you dare stop there. <laughs> um, this section is powered. I don't know what gives. The it, the other line should work, hopefully. I, I hope. 
Well, you know what? I bet that's causing a problem. Oh, well, you know what? It probably is. Am I a moron? Hold on, I think I just figured out the issue. I think I had the point in the crossover set wrong, partially, on the outside line, and it was taking power from the inside line. I swear, if that's what it was, I'm gonna be mad at myself. No, that just seems to be acting up. Well, okay, that's good to know. So, I have something to figure out before I start ballasting. Which isn't gonna be for a while anyways, but... You know. I know I've been doing a lot of layout updates, but truth be told, they're, they've all so far been filmed after Christmas. I believe the first one was filmed after Christmas. Oh no, the first one was filmed before Christmas, but the phone was after Christmas. Uh, and it's now January 12th, so I've been filming this all within the same month. Like, within the same 30 days time frame. Of course, the power doesn't fail me, but the engine comes off the tracks. It might be the MT, actually. I think it's wheelbase causing me grief. That's not good. That is sweet. That is amazing that this works. I mean, honestly, this looks really nice. I'm gonna get a DCC Sound 5MT at some point, because this guy is a split strategy, so unfortunately I can't really do that to him. Now, what's going on underneath this bridge? Well, honestly, I don't, I was gonna put a river, but I don't want to mess with the, the line here. I don't want to mess with it. I like this thing as it is. I don't really want to put a river. So my thinking was build a road that goes in from underneath here, across the tracks, then have it coming over to a parking lot here with the grain elevator, you know, kind of being like a parking lot for the grain elevator on an area for the semis to go get the grain and things like that. It's kind of my thinking. Oh, I just knocked over the 40, F40 beach. But I'm not too sure on that yet. So there's just little Bits of dust all over here. <laughs> now, I guess I might as well give a bit of a channel update here. I tend to... Tend to continue... Sorry, I'm laying on the table right now. Uh, I tend... I think I'm going to continue with just mainly the layout stuff for now. Because I'm actually start... Well, not starting a third channel, uh, but basically the makerspace wants to have their own channel, but no one there understands YouTube, and no one, I think, has the time to do it. Uh, so I got asked if I, my dad asked me if I wanted to do it. So, uh, yeah, I'm doing it. What is this thing here? It's gonna be a little thing on my screen. Nope. Oh, okay, my camera has a function I didn't know about. Whatever it is, I'll figure it out. Um, so I'll be doing that as well. So this will probably stay mainly layout channel, just for now. And as soon as the layout's, like, running. Even if I haven't bounced or anything, I'll start doing more product reviews, which will be nice. But yeah, I think that's it for this quick little layout update that ended up being almost 10 minutes long. <laughs> but uh, this is the Brand Rail Fan, signing off, and I'll see you all in the next one.